everybody, it's Lori here today with my first ever Fender Wax Haul. I'm so excited. <laughs> so I started off the new year with um, jumping in with both feet <laughs> to the Fender Wax world. So I wanted to bring that to you today. I haven't opened it yet. I wanted to do that on camera. Super excited. So before we jump into that, I want to welcome you if you're new to the channel. I hope you decide to subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any great content. I upload at least five days a week. <laughs> Seems like a little bit more lately. There's so much great stuff to share with you guys and I want to bring it all to you as quickly as I can. So you don't want to miss out on any of that content. And I want to welcome you back if you're a returning visitor or subscriber. I'm so happy to have you as a part of the channel. All right. So you ready? I am. <laughs> Let's jump into the vendor wax off. So my first order was with the pharmacist's daughter through Etsy. So I was able to place that order. I placed it on January 1st and I've received it today. I will be uploading on the same day that this is a recording. So yeah, it was very quick turnaround. I was super pleased. I know how you know behind the post office is you know, post office is right now. So I was super excited to get it so quickly. And I was, yeah, <laughs> waiting on the edge of my seat for this. So this was shipped out priority mail and I received it. Now my husband started to crack this thing open and I'm like, no, I want to open this on camera and show my reactions. Okay. So First thing that's in here, which is a little, I'm sure it's the invoice to show what I ordered. Um, received that and a 10% off coupon code. Awesome for my next order, which is very appreciated. Thank you so much. So this is the card of the company. And so there we go. Okay, so we're going to open this up and go through the items. I've ripped this open now. <laughs> and I'm going to put a description in the box below of the scent notes for these items. I'm going to give you my first impressions on this. I'll do a review after I melt um, these items, I'm sure. <laughs> Super excited. That looks really good. Look how nice it's packaged. Very cute. A couple of samples in there. So Let's go through it. I'll put a link to the shop down below and a link of the scent descriptions. Okay, there's a couple of samples. The first one says scrumptious. Sounds familiar. I wonder if I ordered this one. I think I did. But that's okay. I'm happy to get more. There is that for you. I always go too close. So there, super nice size sample. So the scent notes on this say, zucchini bread, fruity pebbles, which is a tart lemon and sweet orange, sweet lavender and corn cereal notes, sweetened with a base of vanilla blended with warm sandalwood and Captain Crunch Berries. Okay. Well, I'm definitely smelling the berries and the sandalwood first. It almost smells a little zippy. I would have sworn there was like some kind of fizzy pop or like ginger ale or something in here. I say pop, sorry. <laughs> From Michigan. Yeah, I don't know. It's good. I definitely get the berry note and the sandalwood and it's like kind of smoothed over with some vanilla. So this will be really nice. Really enjoy that one. Put this back in the little bag there. And the next one we have is the sample of Celebrate. So Celebrate, and it comes in this little two piece of a snap bar, which is perfect um, for one melt. It says, fragrance of orange nectar, peaches, tangerine, cognac, jasmine, and violet. I am definitely smelling orange, tangerine, that type of thing. It's definitely citrusy. It smells like it's nicely smoothed with some vanilla. I would have thought it was like a creamsicle, like sherbet kind of um, smell. Really, really nice. I'm not getting a lot of floral. Jasmine I really like, but it, um, it's harder for me to pick out if it's not super prominent. Just ends up, it adds a really nice touch to 
sense. So this is really nice. Super excited about this one. Okay. So then I got, looks like a lip balm. They make their own lip balms right there. And it says buttercream. So that'll be really nice. It's made out of beeswax and some different oils in here. So super nice. Thank you so much. Okay, so then we've got these packages, which are really cute. Oh, it's a big one. So let's go smaller here. Nicely wrapped there. Really like this packaging. Very, very cute. Okay. So the next item here is this Kimmy Cakes. Look at that. Okay, let's pop this open. I can't wait to show it to you. I don't want to mess it up, so I'm trying to be careful here. Look at how cute. Looks exactly like a cupcake that I'd want to eat. Look at that. <laughs> All right, so the scent notes on this say, this fragrance smells of birthday cake, strawberry white cake, jelly donut, and strawberry jam. I'm getting cake. Smells like, yeah, a nice, wow, birthday cake with some strawberry in here. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's really good. I'm not going to want to melt this. I'm just going to want to sniff this. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. I'm trying to think what else does it say in here. I can't pick out the jelly donut, but, you know, these just arrived and it's cold here, so might take a little bit of time, but I definitely am getting the cake predominantly and the strawberry, maybe mixed with a little raspberry. Oh, that's so pretty. Really, really good. I don't wanna mess it up, so I'm gonna just set it aside and I'll put them all back <laughs> after I'm done with this video, because I'm afraid to, you know, you guys don't wanna watch me putting it all back. You wanna watch me taking it out. Okay, so the next one that I got here Packaged again, packaged so nice. These are so cute. Oh, this is really big. Okay. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know if you can get a sense of how large this is. Okay, so this next item, I, I don't even know if you can fully see how huge this is. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely giant. <laughs> and I just realized that the scent notes are right on, on the top of this, which is awesome. Love this. And you can see right on the label there. Um, date poured, which is really nice too. This says blueberry tea and cakes and iced lemon cookies. I mean, oh my gosh, this is huge absolutely massive. I don't know if I can give you a sense of how large this stuff is. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. This is so good. Oh. Okay. So the first thing that I'm getting on this is definitely the iced lemon cookies. For sure. This is really, really sweet and delicious. Oh my goodness. So definitely iced lemon cookies first. It says blueberry, yeah. Blueberry is not really pre predominant, so if you're not a blueberry lover, it's not super in the forefront. Um, tea and cakes, that's what it says, right? Yeah. Tea and cakes, I don't know. I, I've ordered some items um, with some, um, I wanna say singular scent notes or fragrance oil so that I can be able to pick them out a little bit better because I'm not familiar with that one. So this, I definitely smell the ice sugar cookies. And I would say probably like a vanilla cake I'm getting with a little bit of blueberry in here. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. It's got a little bit of glitter on top. 
I don't even want to cut these because they're going to, you know, they're just going to be destroyed. But yeah, we're definitely going to melt that because that is fabulous. Okay, so, so far I have loved everything. All right, so let's dig in the side here. Oh, here's another sample. Oh my goodness. So this one doesn't have scent notes on it and I don't see it on the website. So there's, two, there's actually, look at this. So there's four pieces in this one. So this is going to be me flying blind. Okay, so this is more of a, I'm going to guess, I could be totally wrong and you guys can all laugh at me, that's fine. It's It smells like a laundry scent. It's a, a fresh and clean scent. Yeah, definitely laundry and clean. I don't know. I hate to even pick out fragrance notes because I could be totally, totally wrong. It's almost a little bit lemony, like... I want to say like ozone or outdoorsy. I don't smell any tree or pine or anything like that in there. That's nice. This is really nice. Very nice. Like I would say bathroom scent. Kind of like a, it reminds me of a, like a spa kind of a scent. Really nice. That'll be interesting. Go out of my comfort zone because I tend to like fruity and bakery scents. <laughs> so that's nice. All right, so let's dig around a little bit here. This is the big part. Don't think there's anything else in the box. Just wanna make sure, okay. So here's nice big packaging here. Everything has been packaged so well. I'm really impressed. Oh yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, yeah. Okay, so then we have this in the oven, it's called open this up and it says cinnamon roll with vanilla frosting sugar cookie and fresh squeezed oranges I am smelling the orange already <laughs> that is big too look how big these are I am like okay I smell cinnamon definitely like a cinnamon roll with orange Yeah, what else does it say? What else, is there anything else that I'm missing? M mainly, okay, cinnamon roll with vanilla frosting. The cinnamon is, is pretty, I mean, it's, it's in there right along with the orange with definitely like a roll. I don't get a lot of vanilla right now, but you know, cinnamon kind of takes it over, but vanilla kind of smooths out cinnamon, so I can see that. Oh, that's, oh, that's yummy. Reminds me of those Pillsbury rolls that have the orange glaze, which Mary Madeline Cookie from Bath and Body Works candle has that smell, but it doesn't have cinnamon in it. This does, and I love that candle. This is oh, yummy, delicious. Oh my gosh. Okay, next one is this apple pie. Okay, this is larger than I thought it would be. The picture makes it look like it's going to be, you know, like little bit larger than, well, like a 50 cent piece, I was gonna say quarter, but no, this is definitely not. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh my gosh, look how cute. Okay, so no scent note for apple pie, but I'm sure we can figure out what that is. Oh my gosh, apple is delicious in here. Oh, wow. Yeah, Macintosh apple, definitely with a nice pie crust. Yeah, there's not, it's not too overloaded on the cinnamon. I'm smelling other spices in here. So nutmeg and brown sugar. Oh my gosh, that's so good. But the apple is delicious. Oh, that's good. My husband's gonna love this. One of his favorites is apple pie. So that's delicious. Okay. Next one is this very delicious. Okay. This is big. This is a lot of wax. This is awesome. There's that little bunt. Okay. Definitely smelling berry. Okay. It says cranberry collins, pomegranate, blackberry scones, and blue cotton candy. Okay. So I'm smelling cotton candy. Yeah, blue, which is what? Blue raspberry? Blackberry. 
Yeah, it's definitely blackberry and cotton candy. Oh, that's good. I don't know about cranberry. I don't smell a lot of cranberry. There's a little bit of pomegranate. Wow, that's nice. Again, these are cold. <laughs> Just came in from the mail truck, so I'm sure that is all going to blend really, really nicely. Ugh. Mm. Okay, so I'm loving everything. All right, so next one is Sweet Lady. Right there. So I can definitely see I'm going to get at least four out of these, if not more, depending on how it cuts or melts. Yummy. Okay. So it says cupcakes at Tiffany's, spun sugar, raspberries, and vanilla bean Noel. I'm definitely getting vanilla cake. And sh it's sugary vanilla cake for sure. Um... A little bit of raspberry, but the vanilla cake is a predominant note, for sure, in here, and, and spun sugar. Yeah, that's what I'm smelling predominantly. Oh, it's so good. Really, really nice. Let's see, what else am I supposed to, raspberry, yeah, vanilla bean, Noel. I don't really know, again, Cupcakes at Tiffany's is another one that I'm not 100% familiar with, because I'm coming from the candle world. <laughs> and the retail wax world so i have ordered some of these so i can smell them so i can pick them out in scents so we'll see that coming down the line but just to my nose this is what i'm smelling on first impression so lovely 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 okay and then i have this sugar coma and i think they were called like lace bars if i'm getting this goofed up i'm sorry but super pretty So there's two of them. Oh, and they're different designs. Nice and big. Wow, that's that's a lot of wax right there. Okay. So it's called Sugar Coma. It says marshmallow, pink sugar, fruity pebbles, and blue cotton candy. Yeah, fruity pebbles for sure. Oh, that's so good. Cotton candy, Marshmallow Fruity Pebbles. So it smells like a overly sugared version of a Rice Krispie Treat made with Fruity Pebbles. That's what it reminds me of. Again, I'm not really sure. I think I kind of know Pink Sugar and I'm smelling that. But again, that's another scent that I have ordered so that I can pick that out better. But yeah, this, oh, so good. Oh my gosh, that's so lovely. I'm getting the lemon in here, the Fruity Pebbles, and I know that obviously that's in there. That's like the first note that jumps out at me on that one. Okay, for the Fruity Pebbles. All right, so then I got these Snap Bars in Tutti Fruity. So it says Mac Apple, Lollipop, and Fruity Pebbles. All of my favorite things. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yeah. Okay, so I smell the apple. Fruity Pebbles is first, but it's funny because the Mac Apple brings out the orange and the Fruity Pebbles for some reason. As I stick it up my nose. Wow, all of these I just want to eat. They're so amazing. Oh my goodness. Yeah, 100%. The lollipop, very sugary, sweet. Oh, wow, you guys nailed it. <laughs> Fantastic. Woohoo! Okay, so next I have Rise and Shine. This one, the little snap bars, and it's um, Coffee House, Zucchini Bread, and Morning Beignet. I'm really on coffee fragrances right now. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Oh. Okay, so this is a rich. Um, chocolate, uh, chocolate, <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at the wax. It's a rich coffee. Wow. I feel like I'm getting caffeinated. Yummy. 
Okay, so this is a really sugary coffee. I can smell the beignets in here. What else does it say? Zucchini bread. That's another one I've ordered so that I can <laughs> pick that out. But yeah, I mean, I get a bready component in here. And I know I've heard that zucchini bread's not super strong. It uses as a base for a lot of things. So yeah, it really just kind of softens the coffee so it's not so wham <laughs> in your face, like I say. Oh, that's delightful. Oh my goodness, lovely. Okay, all right. And my last one here says, bake my day. Look at how cute that is. I mean, all these look like desserts. Jeez, oh, Pete's. Okay, so I'm smelling cinnamon. Let's see what it says. It says, coffee house, cinnamon sugar donut, cinnamon roll with vanilla frosting. Yeah, 100%. I'm losing a little piece here. I don't want to lose any of it. I definitely smell cinnamon roll or cinnamon icing on this. Let's see. Coffee, yeah. Coffee house, a little bit, but it's not overwhelming. If you're not really into coffee, it's not super overwhelming. It's really cinnamon roll and cinnamon frosting that you're getting, first of all. Predominantly in this one. Let's see, what else? Yeah, that's what I would say. Cinnamon frosting, I can see that there's donut in here, for sure, with cinnamon frosting in here, and a little bit of coffee in the background. It's almost like you're... Um, at a bake shop and maybe somebody poured a cup of coffee for themselves. So it's not like you're at a coffee house, which would be different. It'd be the opposite. So yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. So that is my order. I ordered this, like I said, on January 1st. It has arrived already. I cannot believe how large these products are. They are just absolutely beautiful. I mean, this, okay, so I drank Diet Mountain Dew. I mean, it's bigger than, like, like, I can set that on top of that. I know it's a bad explanation, but it's, uh, yeah, this is absolutely huge. Oh, and they smell so good, look so pretty. I'm not even going to want to cut these and melt these, <laughs> but I want to because I want to get melting, so I am super excited. Way to go. So this was the pharmacist's daughter. I'll put the link down below for you if you're interested. Some of the items are, um, a couple of the items I think are sold out, but I am sure they will restock. But oh my gosh, paid for this all myself. <laughs> super happy that they were my first vendor wax order of not just 2021, just overall. So they have hit it out of the park. I am sure I will be a repeat customer. And I'm so happy to share this with you guys and let you know what my feelings are as I melt these and have some empties to share with you. I can't wait. I just wanna take all the wax out of my warmers right now and get melting. So thanks so much for joining me today. Let me know in the comment section down below if you've ever ordered from a pharmacist's daughter. And what was your experience like? Do you have any favorites here that I picked out? Looking forward to your comments. And I will see you next time. Bye, everybody.